Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And um, Google is actually looking at a new way to translate web pages. So, of course, all web browsers will offer you this option to um, make a web page or translate a web page into a different language. And this happens um, especially when you go to a page that isn't in your standard languages that you are using. So for example, the fall of your uh, PC, the only language you have in your PC is English. Then of course, when you go to a French, Spanish, or whatever uh, other website, you'll have a little translate button that'll pop up or a little suggestion that you want to translate this page. And of course, it isn't perfect. It does a certain job, you know, it gives us the, the overall aspect of what it means and what they're saying. But it's far from being perfect. Now, what Google wants to do is use AI. And what that would do is they would send or download to your computer AI models of languages that would go through a web page. And that changes the way things are translated because sometimes when you're on a web page, some of the interactive material might not be translatable. So you'll have parts of the page that will be translated to your language, preferred language, but parts of the page might still be in whatever language um, the website was all about. So what happens next is that you need to have a way to be able to do it all. And that's what Google wants to do. Uh, Firefox is already close to that. Firefox has language models that can be downloaded. So what happens is that Firefox does already try to do a better job at translating web pages than Chrome does. But this is kind of cool because it would make things a lot better in the translate stage. And it would translate parts of pages that never translate. And it would always also um, go faster because the model, the AI model, would be there on your PC waiting for, you know, to analyze. And it would be updated regularly to make sure that, you know, the, the best translation possible is happening. So this is kind of interesting. Um, now they are in discussion with the, the open source community because um, at the basics, all of this is in Chromium, which is an open source project. And um, there's no official time frame when this will happen. But I think this could be a very good thing in um, having us go through the web. And who knows, someday might we might just go through the web and you know, all the web pages in different languages and not even know that we're on a page in a different language that's being translated live, uh, which would make truly internet universal. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.